I can turn into a fish. Chapter 45, First Fight The moray eel was a fast and ferocious demersal fish that lived at the bottom of bodies of water, usually 50 to 80 meters below the water level in sandy and muddy areas. Their adult size was typically around 3 to 5 meters, but they could reach 6 meters in length. I hope it won't attack me. Chu Xian prayed to himself, waving his tail and swimming slowly upwards. At that moment, the moray eel flashed out like an arrow, lunging forward. Chu Xian recoiled and rushed forward as fast as he could. But in his view, he could see that the moray eel was much faster than him. It sped closer and closer, trailing its long and thin body behind him for at least four meters. Chu Xian knew he couldn't get away and that the moray eel wasn't about to give up, so he gritted his teeth and turned around, facing the eel with a cold stare, gaping his mouth threateningly. The eel slowed down, examining him cautiously. The weird fish in front of it was exuding a ferocious aura full of malice, but it felt an instinctual hate and need to hunt and kill. Shit. Chu Xian thought as he stared at the moray eel. It examined him in return. He was panicking, but he couldn't show any fear, so he threatened it with his jaws, exposing more of his sharp teeth. But his move seemed to provoke the eel, or maybe it felt the implicit challenge, and it threw its body forward in an attack. Fuck, I didn't do anything and you just came over. I don't believe your thin ass is that strong. This father will bite you in half. Chu Xian thought as he rushed forward with gaping jaws, facing off with the eel directly. But the eel shook its body and bent nimbly, avoiding Chu Xian's gaping mouth in a flash and countering with a lunge at Chu Xian's belly. Fuck. Chu Xian thought as he felt a shearing pain in his belly, but with the pain came some relief as well. Since he was 1.3 meters long and weighed 70 or 80 caddies, he was big. Although the moray eel was more than 4 meters long, it weighed only around 20 or 30 caddies, and its small mouth couldn't do that much damage with just one bite. Chu Xian flipped around quickly and thrust his gaping mouth at the eel. But to his surprise, the eel suddenly twisted and wrapped itself around his body, looping its four meter long body around him and gripping him tightly. Shit. Chu Xian cursed as he panicked, remembering the eel's ability. He thrashed violently, trying to shake the eel off or escape its grip. In a panic, he quickly realized that none of his efforts were working, and even from his view, all he could see was the eel covering every inch of him. He also saw that as he struggled, the muscles on the eel contracted and wriggled in response. Not good. Chu Xian thought, with fear in his eyes. With the eel wrapped around him, he had no way to fight back, and if he couldn't attack, how could he win? Ah! Chu Xian roared inside as he struggled against the powerful pressure imprisoning him, pushing inward and crushing him slowly, filling him with immense pain. The Strangle Ability Chu Xian thought as the pressure bunched his organs together and pushed out a thin line of blood his mouth. No. No. My new life has just begun. How could I die so easily? Chu Xian shouted desperately in his mind. Chu Xian panicked. Following a desperate thought, he thrashed and flailed. Hit it. Smash it. Peng. He felt a crash and an ache as he felt sharp teeth bite into his head. Fuck. Control. Chu Xian swore and called up his control view. When he saw the mark the eel's teeth left on his head, he was angry and happy, happy that he strengthened his biting force and that his head was the toughest part of his body. Under his control, hundreds of fish rushed forward and attacked the moray eel. With the surrounding attacks, Chu Xian felt the eel's grip relaxing and felt relieved. Enduring great pain, he continued controlling the fish to push the eel towards the edge of the farm. He saw the metal apparatus holding the net in place. With a cruel thought, he rushed the whole mass of fish into it. Crash! Chu Xian's strength combined with the push of all the controlled fish and he smashed them forward. Chu Xian felt like he could hear the moray eel scream of pain. He felt its strangle hold relax even further. 
the mass of fish bounced back, and he smashed them forward again. After five more times, the eel loosened up slowly, afraid of the pain. Seeing this in his mind, Chu Xian immediately seized the opportunity and thrust his body around, gaping his mouth and snapping his teeth down on the eel's body. His sharp teeth and the powerful snap of his jaws pierced the eel, and Chu Xian refused to let go, crunching down and thrashing his head to rip the eel in two. The moray eel struggled violently and its whole body flailed around in the water, but Chu Xian responded with a cold glint in his eyes, snapping down on another part of its body. Fuck. The eel's body had almost been bitten through. There were three distinct segments separated by bites, but the eel kept struggling violently to survive. Mercilessly, Chu Xian opened his mouth and bit again. After five minutes, life finally slipped from the eel's body and it stiffened in death. Chu Xian ground his teeth, examining the dead eel before opening his mouth and swallowing it all down. Ding! Congratulations! Host has leveled up to 16, 1.4 meters long. Strength, speed, toughness, and biting force have all been strengthened. Additionally, you can choose one attribute to power up. Ding. Leveling up has healed all wounds. Obtain strangle ability from devouring the moray eel, Gymnot Horax Reticularis. Two system prompts appeared in his mind. Name, Chu Xian. Status, fish, can transform into a human. Level, 16, newborn little fish, 1.4 m. Combat power, 135. Ability, devour, can evolve from eating smaller fish. Control, can control lower leveled fish. Strangle, can use body to wrap around enemy. Big fish eat little fish system ability. Raymold, can change the shape of self or fish under your control. Every transformation will lower your level or the level of the fish you control.